What's good, Sylvie Game? Back here with another reaction video. Today is December 31st, the last mo day of the year, man. And you know, and you know, man, I did it. I did it. I almost did it. I got one more video to do today. That's going to be in the next one. Hit that notification bell so you notified when I upload. I've been uploading three videos every single day this month. If you didn't know, now you know. And this is number two out of three of three today and we're gonna go ahead and get right into it man 2020 recap recap from countdown from lockdown to now let's go ahead and get into it see what see what this man is talking about so we game we finna blow out yeah so we game we finna close out yeah so we game yeah we finna blow out this was the beginning of the year Kind of nervous. 2020. Oh my God! This guy's gonna edit it in the way. Devastating fires in Australia, killing at least 18 people, forcing tens of thousands from their homes. Oh, it's Iran gonna be one of those. It will take revenge for the U.S. killing. Okay, I hope everybody is prepared. This is might not put you in the best of moods. I can already tell this is not a happy recap. This is gonna be a 2020 recap. Okay of its most powerful military commander, General Kazim Soleimani. A Ukrainian passenger jet plane has crashed shortly after takeoff from Tehran, killing at least 170 passengers. Prince Harry and his wife Meghan are making a radical break, ceasing to be working members of the royal family. Nancy Pelosi will announce a formal impeachment inquiry against President Trump. Retired Los Angeles Lakers basketball star Kobe Bryant has been killed in a helicopter crash. It'll be official. The UK no longer a member state of the European Union. LAPD confirmed that the rapper was shot and killed during a home invasion. Damn, all that just happened in January. Now we're in February. Wednesday morning. The Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi, he's calling for calm following days of sectarian RP violence. Pops Harvey Lowe. Weinstein has been sentenced to 20 years in the first degree that he was convicted for. A public health announcement is broadcast to a near empty street in Wuhan. And even if residents feel well, they could still be a carrier of the new coronavirus. That's March. If you would have bought some stock around right this time, you would be up right now. Tech stock specifically. In China, health officials have announced they expect to see the coronavirus outbreak intensify. The Italian government tonight put the entire country on lockdown. The World Health Organization has declared coronavirus a global pandemic. Today I am officially declaring a national emergency. This is the fastest 10% drop in the highs in the entire history of the stock market. The 2020 Summer Olympics, now the latest major sports cancellation caused by the global pandemic. A Pakistan wow. international air... There was no 2020 Olympics. Lines plane with more than 100 people on board has crashed. George Floyd repeatedly told the officers that he could not breathe after an officer knelt on his neck. The United States is being rocked by an explosion of violence and anger. In more than 100 cities, thousands of workers participated in a protest for both racial and economic justice. This Asian giant hornet found in Blaine, Ooh, Washington shit. can potentially wipe off honeybees in North America. The Democratic back in the Republic day. of Congo is battling a new outbreak of the Ebola virus. Overnight, the sprawl of more than 500 California wildfires. Breaking news from Lebanon. The capital, Beirut, has been hit by a massive explosion. At 43... That, at capital, I reacted to this video too. That shit was crazy. Breaking news this shit from was Lebanon. crazy. The capital, Beirut, has been hit by a massive explosion at 43 after a valiant four-year fight Chadwick Boseman lost his battle with colon cancer Joe Biden has won the American presidential election football legend Diego Maradona has died from a heart attack Pfizer has announced that its anti-coronavirus vaccine is 90% effective several European countries have introduced travel restrictions on people coming from the UK the British Prime Minister has announced a second lockdown in England. Twenty twenty in a nutshell, ladies and gentlemen. Hey man, thanks for the video. Jesus, that was intense. 
I don't even know what else to say about that. I'll link that in the description if you want to check that out. But that was the major events of 2020. Like, comment, and subscribe, man. Hopefully, 2021 is is a whole lot better. So we gain, we finna close out, yeah. So we gain, yeah, we finna blow out, yeah. So we gain, yeah, we finna close out, yeah. Making all these YouTube videos, yeah. You